You even got any balls? Coño, man, I didn't know. And you? I've seen shit with more guts. You didn't say your father was going. Shut your mouth, lady boy. He's my daddy, and I love him. I can't believe you would do this, and you left him there to die. Umberto, what's the problem? Oh my God, I'm going to be an orphan. <laughs> oh man, I'm sorry. How did it happen? It hasn't happened, brother. Alberto, that's his dad. He's over at the wrestling, man. So why the tears? Coño, we just saw some cholos driving over there, man. So why doesn't somebody just go pick up Alberto? Brother, that's what we said to Umberto, and he freaked out. Well, go get him. No, no way, Vic. Don't let my daddy be collected by these two bitches. <laughs> He's a man. The shame will kill him. Well, you go. Oh, I can't drive, man. I'm hysterical. <laughs> God damn it. I'll go get him. But you owe me, you freak. <laughs> Alberto, your son sent me to pick you up. Gracias, señor. You're late. Tarde. I can't be late opening my cafe. In 20 years, I have never opened late. Take it easy, Alberto. No problems. You could not do this job ever, Laszlo. Let's load up. Let's party. Criminal gang who was holding the old fisherman. Why, yes. Yeah, that's why you'll never. I don't feel too good. Your no. So who shot this fisherman's daughter? I did. You? But oh, why? The fact is, Molly, there are a lot of things you don't understand with that dog. Take it easy, my heart. Her <laughs> father missing that girl was now an orphan, and a girl without parents is five times more likely to end up a prostitute, a fallen woman who ruins American marriages, or worse. Oh, that's terrible. I know. So I shot her and threw the heater in the river. I saved her from herself and the rest of society from the kind of filth that preys on the loins of American men. Gordon, you're so brave. Only a man would know such things. What about the fisherman? I'll tell you what. With his only daughter dead, those kidnappers who have taken the fisherman have no one to blackmail. They'll soon have to release him. When they do, we'll be ready. Gordon, you're amazing. Oh! oh. Job. Look, there's something else you've missed, Molly. What? Before she was tragically killed, the daughter said her father was unarmed and never wore a gun. You know what that means? Yes. That's right, Molly. It means he's a sissy. I imagine when he hears his daughter is dead, he'll cry. What kind of a man cries, Gordon? I don't know. When the Take it easy. Boys, uh, my heart. Please. I don't have my medication. <gasps> I don't feel too good. Fisherman Gordon. Don't hate him, Molly. Pity him and help me kill him. Oh, I shall. Looks like the chief. Take it easy! My heart! Get here after the real crime fighting's done. 
Go ahead, Miss Malmstein. I thought I told you two clowns to stop meddling in police business. Listen to me, Chief. I respect you, but the fact is, without me, this town would be over before it's even begun. Oh! Vice Beach should be a peaceful place full of genuine people and Americans. But while searching for this fisherman, we've uncovered a ring of illegal communists and almost worse, a man who was leading girls into a life of hideous and unmentionable vice. Good on you, Moorhead. You're the best man in this place. You've got my backing, whatever you do. Kill whoever you think necessary. Thanks, Chief. You're a good cop in a difficult situation. But, Moorhead, tell me, what men are doing these terrible things in our lovely new town? Not men, Chief. Man. One Take man. it easy! Oh, my heart! Please! I don't have my medication! <laughs> I don't feel too good. But the city needs you. Our burgeoning beach sign community could be ruined by this sort of scandal. You have to bring this man to justice, whatever it takes. I shall, Chief. You know you can count on me. He's probably hiding in a swamp somewhere. Yeah, Moorhead. Firstly, we don't say swamp. We say attractive wetland countryside right on your doorstep should you decide to move to our beautiful part of the world. Sorry. Secondly, if you're heading into the swamp, you'll probably need some help. Me? Help? I'm Gordon Moorhead, not some rusky Chief. I mean this kind of help. Friendly neighbor. <sighs> All this rushing! My heart! She's not so good these days!